Good afternoon, everyone. Liz with New Jersey Gardening. And today what I wanted to show you is my patch of foxglove. And it all started with this little pack here of the foxglove. This particular variety does not bloom the first year. So I didn't know it at the time. I started it inside in March and then I put it outside in May and it didn't flower. Then I did um, some studying about it and uh, this is a biennial. There is another variety that I have here that I bought um, this year that is called Foxy Fox Gloves and as you can read in the label it says blossom in first year and now let's see what they look like look at this beautiful beautiful fox gloves as I mentioned I started them indoors in March and then I took it out here in May and then it just took off I didn't fertilize it or did anything special with them um, and as you can see the dirt here in zone six it is sufficient for them to get all the nutrients that they need to be looking this beautiful i have uh, the variety that has different colors so i have that little pink purple one and here's a little a different one and a light yellow over here i am so surprised I, like I said, I never grown this before, so I, it was something that I wanted to try, and um, and here it is, and it's just looking beautiful. I can't wait to start arranging some flowers with them, some flower bouquets, so people can enjoy, so that I can enjoy them inside the house. Um, this flower is toxic, like a lot of other flowers, so it's not a good idea to eat them. <laughs> But nevertheless, they are just gorgeous. For me, it's something definitely that I'm going to be uh, putting here in my garden every year. We're in May and they are already flowering. Well, that's all guys. I, that's what I wanted to show you. Have a great day. Bye.